Simple songs and simple rhythms for beginners. This is a video reply to subscriber Pretends Awesome. Pretends Awesome writes, could you please do a video for beginners to play? I've watched all your videos and think that they are great. I am just having trouble trying to get a song together. I got most of the songs off to a T, but I am not so good at strumming. So could you do, do it quite slow as I know that you are a fast player. Thanks for everything you've done so far. So far, and I hope that there is more Harbury. Well, Pretends Awesome, thank you for watching and subscribing, and thank you for this comment. There is going to be more Harpery, and that Harpery happens now. Let's go ahead and let's try to build a simple song. Now, when I, especially as a beginner, when I set out to make a song, I wouldn't really think what exactly I'm doing. I would start off playing. I would pluck, and as I was would pluck, I would put those plucks together and start to create a rhythm. And from that rhythm, I'd start to add simple mouth movements. So what we're going to do here is this. And I'm plucking inward. I'm, I'm saying into the heart, but I'm not actually vocalizing. I'm saying ho he he ho ho but i'm not actually saying it i'm just making the mouth movements that i would be to say it but i'm not actually using the vocal cords pluck with me will be ho he he ho ho we're going to pluck slowly try again ho he he ho ho Now we're going to keep this rhythm going. We're going to be saying ho, he, he, ho, ho without using our vocal cords. And we're going to continually do this. Play with me and we'll increase in speed. Now, that's a nice little rhythm we're putting together. Let's add a little bit of variation, a little bit of interest, because as we create those rhythms, you will draw your listeners in and they will figure out the pattern of that rhythm. And they'll be like, oh, I understand. Well, every once in a while, we want to start throwing curveballs at them, a little surprise for the brain. We're going to play that rhythm. And we are going to play And I'm saying, he o he o he, he o ho ho ho. And in doing this, I'm also breathing inward and outward. Practice this a few more times. And then we're going to tie in our ho e he o ho into that rhythm. And if you get those two down, here's another thing that I like to do. I like to pluck inward and outward. I'm plucking inward, and then I'm throwing in a couple outward plucks. Let's try that rhythm there. If you notice, there's most plucks are inward, but on one of them, I'm going to pluck outward. I'm not going to seek to pluck very hard. I'm just going to brush my finger past it. So we've got three nice little rhythms. Let's see if we can play them together. Now 
Now there's a little bit more that we can do there. At parts of your song and parts of your rhythm, open up the corner of your mouth like you're winking while you're playing the harp. Let's see if we can do that simple song again, and near the end, we'll start opening up the corner of our mouth as we breathe inward and outward to add a little bit more points of interest to our rhythm. We start out easy with simple rhythms, tie them together, and then put nice little surprises, nice little points of interest in there. And be sure to be breathing inward and outward, inward and outward rhythmically to add nice little points of interest. Let's go ahead, let's speed it up a little bit. And as you're playing these rhythms, this is my song. My harp is the song of me. Now the song of you may be different than that. So maybe take these rhythms and build upon it. If you make a mistake, keep going, keep that in the song because sometimes your mistakes add a lot of interest to your song. So let's go ahead and let's play that rhythm one more time and feel free to make mistakes, feel free to improvise, keep playing and in that way you can start to make this song your own song and build upon it and come up with your own style of playing because ultimately the jaw harp, it uses your mouth and your head and your anatomy to make music. So ultimately the jaw harp is the song of you. So play the music that is that is you. And if you make a mistake in a rhythm that you predetermined, keep playing. Find ways to add your mistakes and your improvisation, improvisation into your music. Let's go ahead and we'll play that rhythm again. And I'm going to I'm gonna just add my own my own styles of, of playing as well to it. Now I started off with kind of a central rhythm and then I just expanded upon it. I made some mistakes, I improvised, and that's how I come up with my songs. Well, Pretend to Orsum, thank you so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for asking questions. I love getting questions like this. And anything that I can do to help other harpists, I want to do. I want everyone to get better at the harp. At the harp and I, I want y'all to help me get better at the harp as well. Well, that's going to be it for this video reply. Thank you to Pretend Orsum for asking a question. And just be sure to remember, like, share, and subscribe for more Harpery. Harp out. Oh, <laughs>